Uh, as Dr. Francis has already mentioned, I sit on uh, a whole lot of different uh, committees and uh, have a, a whole lot of different hats that I wear. And one of those is as terminology services expert for the Standards and Interoperability Lab for Asia. Just a brief background, there, uh, the SILE Asia or the Interoperability Lab was created um, earlier this year through funding from the Asia Development Bank. And our man mandate is to be able to connect and interoperate disparate systems with one another, maybe hardware or software, software to software, and uh, vice versa. Um, a lot of our work has been dealing with helping our very own uh, Philippine General Hospital, but we have already reached out to several um, private uh, entities and as well as local governments that uh, that have we uh, that we have uh, been helping through this past few months. And one of them is the local government of Navotas. Um, the implementations there they have um, several primary health centers, uh, primary care facilities, uh, if you will, that actually have an electronic medical record system in Navotas. But uh, but the value of having uh, this whole interoperability effort is that when those patients have to be seen in, um, let's say, in the hospital, and uh, the, I've often uh, repeated that if for maternal cases, they will have to be seen in the hospital, which actually uses a whole different uh, health information system uh, for the whole hospital that uh, has their own um, laboratory system uh, for clinical care, for enterprise resource planning, so all of those actually are in one whole um, health information system. What we have done is to try and connect those little um, health information systems or little medical record systems in the Barangay Health Centers and try to connect them to um, the Nagota City Hospital so that patients who actually have to be seen eventually in the hospital won't need to carry their patient records or medical records uh, manually, it, uh, it brings a whole new definition to portability in that sense. So whenever someone, so oftentimes we um, encounter stories wherein um, nahulog po sa bangin, kinain po ng aso, or nabasa po, nalabahan yung record. So, so those things actually or might be very trivial for the doctor, that's actually very pertinent because you won't actually know. So, meron po ba kayong allergy sa gamot na ito? May allergy po ba kayo sa pagkain ito? If the patient does not actually know that for a fact, then that actually uh, has an impact on the, qual on the quality of care that uh, will be given to the patient. So, having that, uh, having that record be pushed uh, or shared um, through an interoperability layer with the hospital is actually very valuable.